Hi, and welcome to Gigi's Planner Room. Today, we're going to be doing something small, something different. We're going to be doing small challenges and playing some games. I hope this is something you consider that is fun for you to watch and spend a few minutes with me. Let's play some games. Thank you so much for staying to watch this video. It is game time and I'm really excited today. Today, I'm going to introduce to you the binder that I have and which games I'm going to be playing. Um, just wanted to make it clear, I did create all of these games myself. I am getting ready to sell them. And I got this idea from a few YouTubers. For example, the Traditional Dollar, the Faithful Dash, Stuff and Budget and a few other channels, which I cannot remember everybody's name or channel name, but I will list the channels in my description below because if this is something that interests you, I really advise for you to go and check out their channel. Let them know that I sent you and subscribe to the channel because they have a lot more games that I don't have and I don't think I'll be playing them because I don't have a lot of money to be playing games. Um, I wish I did, but because I'm not working, I'm limited to that. Um, but once I start working, the story might be different. But like I was saying, go ahead and visit their channels. I hope you like their channels and you subscribe. Let them know that I send you there. So let's go ahead and start my small games here. So first of all, the little bag that I have here, this is carrying my pen just in case I need it. And the marker that I'm going to be using to um, highlight the games that I'm going to be playing. And this idea from this Expo uh, Markers came from Melina Brunson. She tried it. I don't know if she got it from somewhere else, but I know I've heard it from her. And a lot of YouTubers that I follow also got the same idea from her. And it works great. Using these markers, you can clean up the, um, the laminated games with just water. So you don't have to use acetone. You don't have to use alcohol wipes. You don't have to use any of that. Just water cleans them up. I have tried it and it works great. So I am implementing that idea in my games. Um, and then this is my binder. Let me take this money out of here. So this is where I have all of my games. This binder, um, I forgot where I bought this binder. The envelopes are from Purely Budgets. I bought a bunch of them and I've been using them um, throughout my binders. I use it for different things, not just cash stuffing, and they're very sturdy and it's good quality from Purely Budgets. I'll try to uh, link um, his Etsy store in my description below. So I'm gonna be playing the one $2 challenge games. So I'm gonna use for now $2 per game because I'm going to be using my dice, but each balloon here on this one that I created is gonna be worth $1. And altogether I have $16 once I'm done. For this one, I created all these games. I don't know if I said that before. This one is for treat myself. This one, I'm, I will end up with $18 because every cir circle is going to be worth a dollar. And then for this one, it's, it's for a purse that I want. I'm waiting for the purse to go and sell. Um, in this one, every purse is going to be worth $1. So once I finish this one, I'm gonna end up with $20. This one, ice cream cones, I want it for that, for ice cream cones. <laughs> so this one, once I finish, is gonna be $22. I found this ice cream place that we liked because I don't like every ice cream place. And when we go, we spend about like $20 for both of us. So this will be perfect for that since we don't get ice cream all the time. But once in a while, we like to. And that money's gonna be for that. And then this one, I don't have anything to assign it to but every circle is going to be again one dollar so once i finish it's going to be eighteen dollars and i need only six so let me see how many i have one two three four five and then the last one it's this one this is for anniversary and every each flower is going to be worth one dollar and once i finish i'll have 25 so these are the games that i'm going to be playing today 
And these are the ones that I want to sell. And I want to sell this ones laminated like that. You can reuse them as many times as you would like. And then here I have them um, backwards because these are other games that I want to play. Once I finish this ones, I'm going to be coming here. But let me just show you really quick. Let me just flip this around. This is another one. These are diamonds. So basically you have your icons here and then you can just put the amount of each icon, how much you want to you wanna you want them to be worth, and then here you can put or you can write what you're saving for. I have this one for the hearts. This ones are circles with a flower. This ones are butterflies, and then this ones that I also want to use. This ones are from Pro Budgets. This ones are from Pro Budgets, and I want to use this ones really bad. So as soon as I'm done with one of these ones here, I want to jump to her stuff because she makes really pretty things. I already have what I'm gonna use the money for. Um, so this one will be the next ones that I'm going to be using. And then I have some other of mine in here also. So this one from Pro Budgets, this one was a freebie. And I see that she has a lot of freebies. So if you can subscribe to her channel, she's also a new YouTuber, a new budgeter. So if you can give her support, that would be greatly appreciated and also let her know that you came from my channel but for now i'm gonna take this out of the way and actually i'm gonna leave this here like this and i think this is how the game is played if i'm doing it wrong i need for you guys to tell me so this will be one two three four five six i have to play with one dice and the dice is gonna tell me where i need to put my two dollars so, so far, this is what I have. I hope I'm doing good. You guys let me know. This uh, cash holder is from Simple Dollar Co. This is from the giveaway that I won. So I'm really excited to use it for the first time. This one is in black. It has a glitter. And then it has the pink hardware. So let's see how much money we have here to start with. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, and 26. Perfect. I have been collecting dollars, even from my husband's wallet. I took a bunch of dollars that he had, and I'm like, I'll change you this. I think he had like $13. So I took all of his fives, so I can use it for the uh, $5 challenge, and then I took the ones so I can play these games, and I gave him a 20. Okay, I had a phone call was my husband because I sent him to Joanne's to get me something and he can't find it. But anyways, let's go ahead and start this game. So I have $26 to start. I have one die here. So I'm going to see. And number five, which is this one. So I'm going to give it $2. Number four gets $2. Number five gets $2. One, four, I need money and treat myself. Six, that's for the ice cream. Four, that's anniversary. Five, what is five? Ooh, five, it doesn't have anything assigned. I have to see what I assigned to it. That's for the ice cream. Four, and I'm running out of money. Finally, two for the, for treat myself. And the last two goes to four again. So I guess anniversary took everything. Maybe the next time I'll have to have like $5 bills, which is what I've seen the traditional dollar do. Um, she'll do like whenever she gets five on one of the envelopes, she'll put a five and take the $5 out and continue playing. So I might have to do that one day. So let's just put this together. Let's just do it this way so it's easier for me to grab it. And see how much money everybody got. So for shopping, um, only had $2. So I'm just gonna circle two balloons here. Not circle, but color two balloons. And this one's, I left them in paper because um, this is a test that I was trying to uh, do. 
So I left them in paper for now, but the ones that I'm going to be selling, I want to do them laminated because like that, I want you to be able to reuse them. So I have $2 in shopping. This one is for treat myself. This one also got only $2. This one is for my purse. I only got $2. I'm waiting for my purse to be on sale for $150 at least. Um, that's the lowest that I've seen it. So I'm just patiently waiting for it to be on sale again. And I have money in my um, treat myself. And I think I'm going to use that one for my purse also. Because I need to save at least $200. Actually more. Because I want the matching wallet, of course. <laughs> and the wallet, when it goes on sale, it goes to like $100. So, I do need to save a good amount of money. And I don't even think I'm halfway there. So, I have a little bit to go. This one is for anniversary. Each flower is $1. Once I'm finished, I'm going to have $25. So, I was able to collect on this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, so that's five flowers that I can color here. This one is laminated, so this is the way that it's gonna look for you guys. So going to the next one, this one is the one that I don't know what I'm saving money for yet. I'll have to see where I need the money so I can add it. But in the meantime, I have one, two, three, four, five, and six dollars. So I can color three circles right here. This one is also laminated. You just have to wait a little bit for it to dry because this is a dry erase marker. So if you just wait a little bit for it to dry, then you should be fine. This right here is the same thing, just a different color. And I've had that there for like a week because I have been waiting to use this because I've been collecting dollar bills. I haven't been able to go to the bank in like three weeks, maybe more. Um, yeah, I think it's been, yeah, about three weeks. So yeah, well at least so far I have $6 here. And then on my last one, this one is for the ice cream. And I was able to collect one, two, three, and four dollars for the ice cream. So I can color two. So I'm just going to color the cone. Right? I have two. I'm going to let that dry. And then now I'm going to put them all back. But these are going to be the games that I'm going to be playing for now. Um, because I'm starting. This is new to me. I wanted to start low and simple. And because I'm not working, I had to create the games myself. Um, I did buy a few things in Amazon. And I'm waiting for the... Not in Amazon, I'm sorry. I bought a few things from Etsy. And I'm waiting for them to get here. So let's see how things go with the game uh, challenges here in my channel. But for now, this is going to be all for this video. This is a little bit too big. So for now, I'm just going to put this here because I think that's fine in there. And I don't need to use that little bag. I think that works great, which it will let me know this is my $1 uh, game binder so, thank you so much for staying all the way to the end i really appreciate you being here today and playing these games with me if you want to see more videos like this one go ahead and subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell in this channel i like to do budget videos cash stuff in videos and some other games and challenges besides the one that you just saw today i hope you want to stick around and subscribe to the channel i'll see you on the next one bye <music>